This is the country mansion heartbroken prodigy star Keith Flint put up for sale in the days before his death. The iconic frontman, who was found dead at the £1.5 million, $2.788 million property in Essex yesterday, was said to have transformed himself into a country gent while living at his beloved home, The Sun reports. But despite living in unlikely tranquil surroundings, the home still has flashes of his wild man lifestyle, including freaky modern art and a framed picture of an Uzi machine gun in the study. Just days ago the 49-year-old decided to put his beloved four-bed home on the market 22 years after purchasing it at the height of his fire starter fame. Related, Prodigy Singer's final photo revealed he had separated from DJ wife Mayumi Mai, who is believed to have been in Japan when he died. Flint took over the leather bottle 10 minutes from his home to save it from closure in 2014 before stepping aside three years later. Dave Curtin, a regular at the pub, said, he wanted to be a country gent and would turn up in his tweed, but when he'd take his head off you'd see these blue and green devil spikes, he was a normal bloke. He just wanted to be one of the lads, the flamboyant singer had stamped his punk side on the 14th century property. Artwork of a machine gun hangs on the office wall, as well as hanging ornaments including a gothic gargoyle and a stag skull. Elsewhere pictures of some of the eight dogs the pair doted on fill the fairy tale like crooked walls of the home Keith saw as his sanctuary, a country living kitchen complete with aga and a roll top bath can be seen along with a metal framed bed. The details reveal Keith had converted an outbuilding into a gym and one room into an office, meaning he was self-contained at the luxury pad. The orangery is described as a delightful little hideaway, a perfect place to read or watch wildlife. The property also boasts a lake. Keith was born in Redbridge, East London, before moving to Braintree, Essex, as a teenager. He formed the prodigy in the town along with bandmate Liam Howlett. In 1997, a year after their hit Firestarter soared to number one in the single's infamous video made Flint a household name, he purchased the Dunmo property for £200,000 $371,830. Neighbors in the wealthy village said he became part of the community and was often seen jogging and walking his dogs along the country lanes. Jane Addison, who lives nearby, said, I don't know how many dogs he had, maybe eight-ish dogs, and he'd go round the fields on his quad, and when he wanted them to come back to him he'd shout, eggs and bacon, he had lots of birds, canaries. In an aviary, more details on Flint's final hours emergeth prodigy frontman was seen dining with his personal trainer at a restaurant in Essex just hours before he took his own life. Flint reportedly said he was happy after achieving a personal best running time, and also joked with other diners at the Galvin Green Man, the Daily Mail reports. After buying his personal trainer lunch, he allegedly asked if he could take some beer and cider home. A customer told the Daily Mail, My wife and I were dining on an opposite table when my baby sewn threw a fork on the floor, which Keith picked up and said hello, cracking a joke with my wife about it, he seemed really happy, talking to his trainer about how he'd achieved a personal best running and how it made him feel much better, opening his lungs up, the diner added Flint seemed positive, and was particular proud about how healthy he felt, there was no one else in the pub for him to be putting on an act for. Yeah, I was surprised and got it as a fan of his work when I heard that he'd taken his own life so soon afterwards, the diner said, he was dressed casually, with flashes of dyed blonde hair escaping out the back of a tweed flat cap, wearing a green combat jacket and trousers over an orange t-shirt and trainers, and he was buying lunch for his personal trainer. He also chatted with another female regular there who was dining with her daughter, Prodigy worried about Frontman security Flint was assigned a full-time security guard because his bandmates were worried about his safety. 
He was trailed 24-7 by a local minder and said he'd been put on health watch by bandmates after anti-hunt protesters stormed his English pub, Keith's Pub, the leather bottle, became a meeting place for the local hunt, and this information got out online, a source told The Sun, a couple of times, anti-hunt protesters turned up and made a fuss. It really upset Keith and I know the band and the management were a bit worried for him, he had a local minder, a big Essex lad, who would go everywhere with him, Keith told me he'd also been put on health watch by the band. He hinted they were concerned for his health and wanted someone around to keep an eye on him, the prodigy have yet to comment on the claims. It comes as the star's estranged wife, Mayumi Kai, deemed him a true pioneer and legend, the DJ and model posted a Japanese newspaper story about Flint on her official Twitter account, which included a statement lauding Flint from his bandmates. It has been claimed Flint had fallen into depression after his split with Kai forced him to put the couple's farmhouse on the market. Flint was last seen by locals two days before his death as he ran the Chelmsford Park run in a personal best time of 21 minutes 22 seconds on Saturday morning. Fellow runner, journalist Rob Hadgraf tweeted the picture and wrote, Sad news about Keith Flint comes only two days after he'd looked in great shape and spirits, storming. Round the Chelmsford Park run in a PB, the iconic singer was discovered, unresponsive, in his home on Monday morning after police and emergency services were called to the property. The Prodigy's co-founder Liam Howlett said Flint had taken his own life, famed for his devil horns haircut and intense stage performances. The iconic 90s musician was performing just last month in Australia and New Zealand on a world tour set to run until May. Flint, who once dated British TV star Gail Porter, was the face of the rave band in took center stage on their best-known hit Firestarter, the single which launched him as an icon. His suicide came days after he put his beloved home on the market following his devastating marriage split from his wife who was in Japan at the time of his death. Howlett, who founded The Prodigy with Flint in their hometown of Braintree, Essex, wrote The news is true. I can't believe I am saying this but our brother Keith took his own life over the weekend, I'm shell-shocked, f asterisk 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 angry, confused and heartbroken r i p brother, if you or someone you know needs help, contact Lifeline on 131114 or beyond blue on 1-300-224-636. If it is an emergency please call 000 with the sun.